again, keep. Why am I getting called back here this time? What is going to do? Oh, Garnet? Garnet. Garnet, turn on. Uh, uh, what the? Uh. How are you here? Where? You're in the Freddy P you're in Fazbear Freddy's Pizzeria with the Glam Rocks. How are you here? You were still back at home. I have no clue. Oh, you're sounding out of robotic. Hold on. Hold still. There it is. The movers move one of your wires, making your voice box not work right. There. Okay. Does that feel better? Yeah. That's just weird. That makes no sense how you got here. My house is like an hour and a half away from here. Oh. Yeah. I you didn't know? even know this place existed. Because I was waiting to get all of you guys online first before I brought you here. Hmm. Oh, she. Back. I didn't even. What the? <laughs> what is going on? Dang it, the server thing connected, and so we're s- Let go! Oh, I hate it when this happens. Can you move? I can- I can- I can bounce! You moved. You're moving? Yeah, you moved too, a little bit. But now you're only like jumping and turning your head. I'm trying to move. It's like my legs are frozen. Ah! Was this you, Hoshi? No, someone else did this. It's well, basically, this this area for some reason is connected to a game, and we get partially connected to, so we kind of get stuck in the stuff. When oh, oh, you're free. Oh, bleh. I don't know who. I must have clicked a, a hiding game on accident. Hide and seek yeah. game. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, well. Alright, well, this is the pizzeria. This down here this is, is. also confusing. I know. This down here is the gift shop. Basically, where people buy merchandise, plushies, clothes. Ooh. Yeah, and upstairs, this is the this is like the office for a lot of the okay, a lot of other stuff in it. This is like the check-in counter. Okay. Now this part's a little weird because how these stairs are. Yeah. And here's the main part of the pizzeria. Oh. Yeah. Oh. It's decorated for, for, um... Christmas. Yeah, that. That's why I'm wearing this, because it's for the Christmas season. Normally, oh. the colors I wear oh, are yeah. much different. Remember? When you first yeah, turned on? Mm. Alright, this is the kitchen yeah. area. And this is the freezer. But don't touch any of the food on the trays. It's, I don't know why they... The, especially on that table over there, it's all stale. Oh. Yeah, that's I'll do that. Disgusting. Yeah, that is gross. Thing. Yes. This is where all the people eat. And this is the stage. Wow. You can hop on the... Yeah, yeah this is where the glam rock animatronics perform. Mm. Yep. And over this way, this is all the... These are the bathrooms over here. They finally got an elevator open. So, okay. up here is another level. Okay. This Let's is see. the arcade. Oh. Yeah, it's pretty daggum big. So basically, more people can be up here. They can eat with and watch their kids play. And nice. where's, where's the other level? What's that room? Huh? What's that room? Uh, that is a play pit. Basically, it's like a ball pit, and then there's like these little 
Watch out, the floor does sink down. It is a ball pit after all. Wow. And this is like one of the tunnels. Oh no. Are you scared of tunnels? Um, I may or may not be claustrophobic. Oh shoot, I forgot. To make, I made y'all guys human-like, so I gave you slight fears. Goodbye. Uh, it, 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 okay. Hoshi, Hoshi, save me. You're fine. These aren't actually that tight. They're just plastic. So, as an animatronic, you can break out quite easily. Well, then that's not good. You're an animatronic. Children can't do it. I know. Uh, don't you start being a smart butt with me, but darn it. Okay, so... Then we got the next floor. Which is, it says over here. Third floor. Let's just... Well, this one has... Another floor, okay. Yeah, this place is like four stories. So this is the performance area for the, like, the bigger parties and such. Um... Yeah, so they'll rent out this area for like big parties and stuff, and people either do karaoke up here or the animatronics. Will, other animatronics will perform. Oh. And over here is one of the private party rooms. Oh. Yeah, each I think each corner has a private party room. Okay. Yeah, and this. What does this go to? Oh, this is not. This is the stairway down. Oh. Okay. Then we have the basement slash repair area, which will kind of freak you out a bit because it is kind of dingy. Oh. But it's nothing bad, I promise. I checked it out. I checked it out recently. Okay. Okay, let's go this way. Down more stairs. Yeah, this place's elevator don't work quite just yet. They're still having some kind of issues. Oh. So to get back, you can either go through the stage or go through these side doors here, which is employees only. Fortunately, I am a co-owner, one of the co-owners of Fast Bears. Oh, that, that's, that's good. Yeah. Okay. It looks spooky as heck down here for some strange reason. I don't know why they never fixed this. Ew, cobwebs. I know. Ugh. Oh, yeah. This is basically because there's animatronics down here. They don't want any regular people down here. So, oh, yeah. It's... Animatronics. Yeah. Yeah. So I did make you where you can register different animatronic series. Do you know what this one is? That is Foxy. No, what series? Oh, the originals. No. That's Rockstar. That's... It... Oh. Oh, yeah, I see the difference. Yeah. Alright, so... Oh, this might freak you out, but... There's Puppet. <gasps> Yeah, so just don't look at her and walk this way. Okay, okay. Yeah, I just wanted to warn you so you wouldn't freak out the next time you came down. Okay. Breathe. Mimic breathing. You good? Yeah. Yeah. So we'll probably be coming down here quite often because we've been getting a lot of strange clues. Hey, 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 calm down. Wait. Okay. What did they... Okay, I'm... what did they just say in the... Game. Oh my mm -hmm. gosh. I was just reading through the this the image, the chat thing they have going on, and it just said something really weird. Which I'm not going to say because you're still kind of oh. innocent. You just read it, didn't you? Yeah, I did. Oh goodness. Ugh. Okay. Now, there's a few places I do not want you going near. It's usually, it's near this back wall. Don't flip this lever. Don't go in that corner. What a, I don't know what this is, but don't mess with it. This looks like an elevator. An industrial elevator, which, if you fall through, it can destroy your arms. So you <laughs> have animatronics before. And there is another area over here. It's to the sewers. Don't go through that. Okay. That sounds stank. disgusting. It is really gross. I really hate it when when molten when any sort of animatronic with molten pops up and I don't know which molten it is. No. Scary. 
Yeah, I mean, there's, I've met with one, and he's not too bad. But there's other versions that pop up because of how this this world is. Yeah. These fires got dust on them. Yeah. Ew. 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 Yeah, it's very ew. <sighs> Back in light. Yay. Uh, Feel better? Yeah. Yeah, I'm just... I don't know if you remember this song, but I am not human. No, I do remember that. Okay, good. Because I know sometimes working on animatronics, when you input information in, they always don't remember exactly. Mm. How in the tarnation? Wait, does that? That can't be John. Is that? Um, I don't know. Who John is. John is the current CEO of Fazbear's. Even though he can be a right butthead, no, that's just someone dressed up as him. Oh. Basically, he okay. was Brian Film's best friend before he turned jerk. <sighs> Brian Films was the creators of the Glam Rock Animatronic. The ones that are on this stage? The ones are supposed to be on this stage. And he owned a place called Freddy Land before this. And due to an incident not a lot of people know of, but he died. Ooh. Basically, not a lot of people know this, only a few members of Fazbear Zoo, but he died protecting another animatronic from an evil, evil thing known as a a virus, basically a virus rabbit. A vi oh, wow. Very evil and has been plaguing this company for years since Afton first went insane. So, if you ever see anybody with glowing, swirly purple eyes, run. Okay. Yeah. Like, he can't affect me much, but he can hypnotize, pe hypnotize people. And I don't want him doing that to any of y'all. Yes. Because I specifically designed y'all to protect children. Make children smile, make them laugh. Because a lot of Afton's animatronics... I discovered this the other day, but a lot of the bigger known ones have hydraulics in their jaws. Giving them the force to crush heads. That's what caused the bite of 83. I'm sure you've heard about that. Because I gave you all the ability yeah. to access the internet. Yeah, yes, I, yes. That's why I made sure y'all didn't have hydraulics in your jaws. Because there was some, there was linkage with that, but there was more to it I didn't know of. And that caused Afton to go insane. So now, majority of the only Afton left alive ish is Michael. What do you mean ish? <clears throat> How do I say this? Kind of zombie? You? No, 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 not quite like that. He He's alive, but he can't eat. Like, he can breathe, he just has no digestive. Organs. Okay, what does this what does this make you feel when I say it? Scooper. Pooper. No. The scooper was at the Circus Baby Circus Baby World's location. Basically, if animatronic gets hit by that, they dead. Oh no. So when a human gets hit by it. It's usually instant death because animatronics can typically survive a few seconds, but somehow Michael lived because of an animatronic name, Inard. That sounds gross. Scary. And, and gross. gross, yes. Yes. I don't know what happened with Inard, but somehow Michael survived. And instead of looking human, he's purple. Oh. So, I worked recently, I finished developing a, I found a, co I found a concept he left for me called the Illusion Disc. And I finished recently making him one so he could look human. 
Okay. Basically, he would he would have he might have spurts where it wouldn't hide his skin completely, but he would look and seem and honestly smell like a human because it would distract away from the <laughs> smell. Yeah. You can imagine why I want to do that. I mean, if it wasn't for Michael, I also wouldn't be alive right now. He was my dad's best friend. Saved my life several times. So, yeah. Now, this is the part it's going to freak you out a little bit. We're going out there. Oh. That is, we're in a place called known as the Star Mall. Okay. It is one of the first locations, mall locations owned by Fazbear's. Okay. I know you're claustrophobic, but this will feel very overwhelming because this place is massive. Okay. Alright, so here we go. What? What? Um. I said it was massive. This well, place is two stories. Is that like the Glamrock Freddy? Yep, that's Glamrock Freddy. Purple eyes. No, the. Those are not hypnotic. That's just clay. Okay. If they're glowing purple eyes with swirlies, that's the danger. Okay. Because one of my other friends, his name is Foxy. His nickname is Foxy. I don't know his actual name. He's a fox. He's a partial fox, even. He has a red eye and a purple eye. But he keeps an eye patch on the purple eye most of the time. Okay. Let's go up here. <sighs> now this is one of my favorite parts other than the pizzeria. This water fountain area. That's pretty. Just don't go in the water yet. Your, your system hasn't been quite ready to go in water just yet. Okay, I won't. Yeah, you're one, actually one of the few from the get-go that's designed to be waterproof. And fireproof. Wow. Mm-hmm. Too many animatronics have had very bad issues because of fire and water damage. So you have actually a specialized wire and coating to protect you from that. Do you remember that when I first put in that really weird looking like bluish reddish wire? Like yes. right near your chest? That's the wire that protects you from that kind of damage because it's basically, it's magic. Yeah, because you guys are AI sentient magic beings. Unfortunately, I also placed a temp when you were looking at place a temporary waterproof spell on you, so in case you do fall in water, it doesn't cause any problems. So you said while you weren't looking, was that supposed to be a secret or something? No, I just didn't say. I just couldn't say it because of that. Oh. Because if you say that spell, it can cause you to the frisk because your body isn't quite ready for it yet. Mm. So yeah. Another thing is, you'll see a lot of strange things like we have today. Like the, that molten animatronic. Yeah. So basically you'll see characters from all sorts of shows, games, and such. And yeah, such. Is Hoshi waterproof? Yes, he is waterproof. Okay, because he just fell in, and then he's met. I he was the first one I ever made. He's the first robot I ever made. Hmm. So I kind of had to test out stuff. And up here, this is the entrance. And this Big is star. Like, you never go outside the entrance without me there. Okay. Because if the if the protection if those gates are shut, if you try to go out of it, they'll shock the ever living snot out of you. Yeah. Yeah, that's the reason why you have to be careful. Can you see that weird purple glowing thing? Yeah. That is a portal. Oh. So if you see that kind of purple glowing thing, just ask me what it is before you go, because that can be good or bad. Okay. The only time you have to worry about purple swirly glowing things is people's eyes. Okay. So that's the only time I have to worry about it. Why is there a lefty animatronic? Crap. 
cleared. Are you hiding? No. What are you doing? That this is the this is the loading dock area. Hmm. Yeah, I found quite a bit of information here the other day. Just couldn't but I couldn't find anything else. Okay. Oh yeah, if you see me have this out, this is this is a fireworks bow. Watch. Whoa. Yep. It's also really good if you're trying to find stuff that's stuck in things, because the flat knit can actually cause enough force for things to pop open. Oh. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um. So how do you feel about this garnet? I know it's pretty uh, scary and new for you. Yeah. But are we even going to talk about how I got here? That, let's just put it up to the forces of magic. I have no other explanation because okay. no, none of the Fazbear members, movers, know where our house is. And it's kept that way for a reason. Because I've had people try and steal my designs. Steal your guys' designs. Oh. Yeah, and the way I have y'all designed, you guys are actually one of the uh, m most high-tech beings in the world. Because your designs act like humans. You're basically sentient. Hmm. And there's another thing you should know. If you see animatronics that you know aren't like you guys, are actually possessed by human souls. Um. Yeah. I know, I it's know. really scary. Um, how? That's a science I don't delve into because soul magic is very, incredibly dangerous. Okay. I only use enough of it to know if there's a soul. Because I am half angel. I can sense souls. But I don't delve any further than that because manipulating someone's soul if you're not a demon, a certain type of demon rather, is incredibly dangerous and can take your life and turn you into a monster. That's not good. No. So if you see me kind of back away from our foxy friend, because he's kind of weirding me out a bit with the salt talk. Okay. So it gets really, really oddball. But I'm trying to think where we can go that be comfortable to sit. Probably over in front of the pizzeria, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Excuse me. Okay. I'm honestly well, surprised my wings didn't pop out that time. Hmm. Come on, let me sit. Let me sit. Eh. We're floating. The crap. Put feet on the table. <laughs> Let's just sit on the stairs. Okay. Okay. There we go. Even though it's not quite as comfortable, it's a little better than floating in thin air. Yeah, definitely. Uh, uh, Ugh. Ugh. Oh, well, there they are. Uh, wait, wait, huh? Oh, yeah, damn it. <laughs> Let me see if I can make them go back. Okay. Ah. Ah. Still not quite used to them popping out like that, because in this world they pop out as like particles. Which they know don't don't normally. Cause they look like actual freaking wings most of the time. That that's weird. I know. Like I said, this world is odd. Yes, it is. 
That child looks very... messed up. That's not a child. Thing. Um. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, can you tell me, like, I never put this in your, like, what are your likes and dislikes? Like, I know you've had access to the internet so you kind of learned the things you've liked and stuff. Um. Oh, well, yeah, I'm claustrophobic. Oh, jeez, I forgot to fix your hands. I forgot to paint the rest of the red on them. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Whoops. Yep. Okay, you're claustrophobic. Um, well, I didn't like the basement at all. Yeah. Or the puppet. Yeah, um, that's another thing. The puppet, depending on the kind of puppet, it may be possessed. Okay. You don't have to be afraid of this one because she's a nice one. It's good. Unless you think, talk about the nightmare animatronics. What are the nightmare animatronics? <sighs> I've only learned about them a couple months ago, but they're basically animatronics that haunt you in your sleep if you become their victim. That's what happened to Afton's youngest. The re research my father found out what happened, and basically... The Nightmare Animatronics are a heck of a lot scarier than the, the originals or the Withered Animatronics. Because they have like tons of teeth. Mm. Yeah. But I don't know exactly the whole thing. Okay. But yeah. But if you're looking at the puppet or security puppet, they're, they're typically they're very nice. That's good. Still look creepy, though. Yes, trust me, I know. So, like, do you have, like, a favorite color and such? I like green. You like green. How about this? I'll give mm -hmm. you some... I'll give you some dark green gloves. How's that sound? Okay. Good. Alright. Here's another thing I want to ask you. Do you know what SCP means? S C P Yes. No. Basically it's a short term saying of supernatural protainment supernatural protection confinement. Basically anything that is not normal, which is what I'm classified as. It can be either of scientific, natural, or mythical nature. Hmm. And you'll probably hear it sometimes, but I do know a few people, other than myself, that are classified as SCPs. One of which was very heavily traumatized due to experiments on him. And let's just say this guy is old. Very, very old. He looks young, but he's very old. Old. Okay. Like, what, about, what about that foxy person? Um... Honestly, I don't know exactly, because he's a mix of very different beings. Okay. For me, I'm classified as SCP because I'm half fairy, half angel, two very powerful hybrid, two very powerful beings. Okay. So Foxy, let's just say he's a unknown collaboration of things for now. <laughs> That's not... That's not the same person. Okay. Oh god, oh god. What? What? Oh god. I'm in the Chipotle. I'm in a place filled with donuts. Is it gone? Okay, it's gone. Alright, you can come out. Oh, you're in Duncan. Oh my god! It's over here! It's over here! Stay in there! Stay in there! Stay in there! It's gone. Okay, okay. Oh, Lord! 
<laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, last time I was near a tr that kind of animatronic, they're known as Twisted. One literally bit my arm off. <sighs> but you, but you have both arms. Look at. You can see a scar on one of them. It goes all the way around. Oh. Oh yeah. yeah. My powers bursted out and gave me my arms back. Oh she. I have to send you away. Is it gone? I'll go I'll go see if it's gone. I'm sending Hoshi back home. <sighs> okay. Is it gone? Is it gone? Um Yeah. It's okay. gone. I think it went into the pizzeria. Oh. Yeah, that traumatized me. Having my arm really but it was a twisted wolf animatronic. <sighs> I have nothing against wolves. I love wolves, but that one scares the living crap out of me. Yeah. I'm sorry for scaring you. It's just <sighs> scary. Yes. I mean there is a twisted body animatronic that's not too bad. He's very childlike. Yeah. So, he's okay. He's very nice. But that reason why is because he's actually an, a, an alternate of Brian, the the former CEO. Who died? Yes. You'll come to learn with Fazbear's alternates exist. Alternate dimensions exist. Which is weird. Yeah. Ow. Stupid bush. Audience? Oh, ah, come on. Come on. Eat. Uh, You're fine. You're shocked, okay. It just takes a lot of practice to land. Yeah. It does feel weird until you get used to it. I don't recommend you jumping off any higher than that, though. Okay. I won't. That's good, because you... <sighs> Let's see. Yeah. Dang it! <sighs> Sorry, I just couldn't sleep last night. Hmm. Wait. There it is. This is this is the former owner, Brian. This is the plushy version of him. <gasps> I see something that I recognize. What? Zat Sing. <sighs> the Among Us characters. Never played the game. Have you been playing Among Us on my PC at home when I'm not there? Uh, um. Garnet, uh, you can tell me the truth. Yes. <sighs> okay. Fortunately, I did set up a separate account if y'all want to spend money, but you use it sparingly. Understand? Mm -hmm. You don't need to be scared, okay? Okay. Let's see. Oh, this is Minecraft characters. This is what people see. We're like these skins. We're chubby? Oh, no, we, we don't look human to them. We look oh. blocky and don't move normally like we look like to each other. Ooh. Oh. oh, I know this. Pokeball! I like Pokemon. What? Me too. What's your favorite one? <laughs> um, like my favorite Pokemon or? Pokemon. I've only played three of the games. Okay. Uh, oh, what the I heck is this mango head doing in here? <gasps> that looks it's kind of like a foxy. It's- yeah, Mangle is a type of foxy. It's very broken. Ow! It's, it's yeah. shocked me! Ow! Don't touch that. This looks like the baby clothes section. Hmm. What is this? So we- oh, because we can't- we went through Toys R Us and came out of Babies oh. R Us. Yeah. Oh goodness, is this what I think it is? Pink? It's another clothing store. What is pink? I mean, I know the color. It's a kind of clothing store. Now, if you see a place named called Victoria's Secret, don't go in there. You do not need to see that. 
Okay, let's see. Uh, okay. Oh, Dick's Sporting Goods. This is a Sporting Goods place. I love coming in here. Where's the archery? Well, the last time I touched a ball of any sort. Um. What did you do? Um, I didn't break your window. Did it change? Did it immediately fix itself? Maybe. Then that's okay. Just don't do anything upstairs. Because the back area has windows so y'all can see okay. it. Ikea? What the heck? This place is huge! Oh. Holy guacs. Um. That's a bedroom. Um. Bedroom. Looks like a dining area. Well, there's a staircase. There's an upstairs? Apparently. Oh, there's more layouts. Uh, bathroom. Kitchen. Another bedroom. A, either a library, office, or a living room. Oh, and then oh it leads up to the- part we're on the now. second floor now. Okay, interesting. Oh, no, I love that coming to this place as a girl. Little girl. It's a girl's, uh, shop- it's a little girl's shopping area. Two pastels, ugh. Hmm. I would come for, like, the little knickknacks and stuff. Like the plushies and, like, the fans and stuff. I know that, too. Plushies! Oh, there's a pet store! <gasps> That's Vulpix. Vulpix? Cool. There's a Vulpix plushie. Cool. Yeah. I found PetSmart. And a Peppa Pig plushie. Ew. Found PetSmart. PetSmart. Oh, look at these little guys. Oh, why do they have a puffer fish? Can get a pet? No, not right now. There's a freaking puffer fish. These are not legal. There's two puffer fish in here. What the heck? A fish. A fish. House. We got this. puffers. Eh. Hey. So we got oh, a husky, a pug. Look at that, wee wee. There's a full. Look at the full wall of hamsters. Hamsters. Looks like boxes of food, play toys, birdhouses. Back here. Okay. Oh, this is back here to the register. Wow. Yeah, this place has got a lot going on. I think Fazbear's funded most of it. Oh, this is a place I loved as a kid. Build a bear. Basically, you can just pick your stuffy, design it, and stuff it with stuffing. Oh, I thought it meant. Build a Freddy. No, like, it's different. Build a bear. Because basically, because like this machine that. builds a stuffed animal up with stuffing. You can probably build Freddy toys here. Well, that that made me think of Freddy, the big bear. Uh, probably. Oh, don't know what that was. Yeah. This looks like it's oh, another employee-only elevator. Let's see. Okay. Oh, we're back around here. We're at McDonald's. Ugh. I love their McDonald's. food. McDonald's? I like their food. It's just, I worked there temporarily. Did not like how people treated me. Had very rude people. Like, very rude. Hmm. Oh my gosh, this McDonald's is freaking tiny. Yeah, that's well, it's in a mall. So they're it can't usually be, like, quite a bit bigger than that because they have like a bigger kitchen area. Was this? DQ. Yes. Ooh. I was born in Texas, so this brings back home for me. Do you know what DQ DQ is for? No. Dairy Queen. I just see ice cream. Yes, they're well known for their ice cream and blizzards. Wait, who's who's the queen of dairy? It's just a name. Oh. This, oh my goodness, this is Panda Express. This is a Chinese food place. China? Chinese, not China. Stop it. 
Okay, this is Duckle Bell. Duckle Bella. That's a purple taco. It's a bell, not a taco. Oh. Okay, we dead end over here. Let's go across the walkway. Where's that walkway? Where's the freaking walkway? It's eh. this way. There it is. Oh, wait, I want to try some. I'm going back. What are you doing? Don't right climb side. across Freddy's face. That's a too big of a jump anyways. It's not. How are you going to get up? Freddy, help me. <laughs> we can check out the bottom. You can check out the locations down here. I landed on the balloons. They saved me. You're lucky you didn't bust those. Let's see. Popeyes not a fan of their not a fan of their food. Chipotle where we hid in earlier, or I hid in earlier. Yeah. Wendy's decent. Let's see. What is this? Panera bread. They're pretty good. A uh, healthy fast food. I like bread. You're. When have you eaten bread? Yeah. When? I don't know. I've just I've just eaten it at your house. <sighs> Stay. Turn around. I'm gonna open your back. It's gonna feel weird. There. I did it again, dang it. You joined the thing? Oh no, people joined. <laughs> I was trying to work on your back and it did that. Oh no. I'm just not gonna look. Because I wasn't trying to, anyways. So I'll just wait here until it's time. So I'm just going to sit. And okay. it won't let me sit. Dang it. Oh no. Oh, oh, you got spun around. <laughs> no, let me move. Oh, you're floating. <laughs> oh. <laughs> let me go. You're still floating. I'm jumping. You're just floating. Oh, wait, now you're not floating. I have to wait. Stuck. I am stuck. Yeah, uh, Foxy kept doing that yesterday, too. <laughs> he kept hitting the button, but no one joined. <clears throat> oh, my lord. I will just eat bread. No! I have to install a system to you where it makes turns out into energy for you. You can get in your teeth and get all stuck and stuff. Okay, I'll wait. Okay, let's try that again. Let me check something quick. Alright, well I probably, we should probably take you back to the pizzeria though, so you can go shut down safely in there. Because I gotta head back, because I have to be back for the night shift later. Because there's been strange occurrences. You probably need to charge. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Okay. You just gotta figure out a good place for you to shut down and charge. Because I don't want to put you in the basement. Oh, I don't want to go in the basement. I don't want to put you in the basement. Let's see, where's the place up here on the stage I can put you safely? That no one really looks at. Oh. I'll have to wait until the game is over with because it won't let me go any further. I did not want to do the game. It was an accident. <laughs> Thank you. Um, okay. You can probably hide in here. Okay. Uh, you want me to set up a charging spell? 
There, that should keep you charged, okay? Okay. okay. Get some rest. Okay, bye. Bye.